everybody. Welcome back for another 16-bit spaceship shooting edition of Show Reviewkin, where today we'll be taking a look at one of my favorite 16-bit shooters and one of my favorite Konami games as well, and that's Gradius 3 for the Super Famicom and SNES. This was initially released in arcades in 1989 and on the Super Famicom in 1990, shortly after the console launched, and it was actually one of the five launch titles for the SNES in North America, along with games like Mario World and F-Zero, and it was the only launch game not published by Nintendo themselves, so it's safe to say that they had a lot of confidence in this game, as well they should have, because I think this is a great early showcase of what the SNES was capable of in terms of visuals, sound, and of course, gameplay. One of the things that I really like that Konami implemented in this game is that you have a lot of options for your ship as far as power-ups go. You're given four different power-up strings to choose from along with two different shield options or better yet, you can edit together your own power-up string that gives you four different power-ups to choose from, some being created specifically for this version of the game for each of the six slots. So you can mix and match at your leisure until you find the combination that's right for you. Pretty much anything you choose will be really useful though, especially since each of the game's 10 stages offers up a variety of challenges in terms of enemies, stage designs, stage hazards, and the myriad of boss battles you'll be contending with. There's always something that works better in some areas than others. The challenge is also something I really love about this game, particularly that while it is still a very tough game, especially if you're a beginner, it does feel a bit more fair than its predecessors, and you are given a few different difficulty settings to choose from, so it's difficult without feeling insurmountable, and it's a lot of fun. The controls are responsive, the collision detection is on point, there's a lot of variety in the gameplay, just an all-around great shooter in my opinion, definitely one of the best you can play on the SNES at least. Okay, so I can't talk about this game without mentioning the glaringly obvious drawback of this being an early SNES shoot-em-up, and that's the excessive amounts of slowdown throughout the game. Pretty much any time you're firing your weapons as enemies are on screen, the game will slow down, sometimes a little, but usually a lot. Oddly enough, though, this doesn't really diminish my enjoyment of the game. It actually makes it easier for me, which I really appreciate after seeing what happens when an SA-1 chip is added to the game to remedy the slowdown. It becomes a way tougher game when it's running at two to three times the speed. So if you're like me, then you won't mind the slowdown here, but it must be said because it is present throughout the entire game unless you're using that patch. That aside, I think the visual and audio presentation in Gradius 3 are amazing, with the soundtrack in particular being one of my favorites on the console. There's lots of high-energy music that is perfect for a shooter and very memorable as well, the track titled In the Wind from Stage 3 being my personal favorite. Plus, for a launch title, this is a great-looking game. The stages are varied, colorful, and nicely detailed. The boss monsters and huge spaceships look great and feature some truly excellent sprite work, and the intro and outro cutscenes were some especially nice additions, the former getting you pumped to play the game, and the latter giving you a satisfying conclusion. So to sum up, this game looks and sounds amazing and features gameplay 
that keeps me coming back on a regular basis even 30 years later. So if for whatever reason you've never played Gradius 3, whether it be on the SNES, SNES Mini, Virtual Console, PS2, PSP, Arcade, or whatever else it was released on, remedy that situation immediately. Play Gradius 3 today. It's undeniably awesome. <laughs> 